Hey, I'm Dr. Bob Payne, a veterinarian at SouthKendall.com. How to treat cataracts in dogs? That's a question probably for an ophthalmologist. There's a thing called veterinary ophthalmologist that they are board certified, they have a degree above mine, and they're well qualified to treat it. They can take these cataracts out by surgery. Uh, sometimes they leave them in if they're not ready to be taken out. Cataracts can cause glaucoma, so you need to be aware. The biggest problem I see is people think their dog has cataracts and they really have nuclear sclerosis, which is a normal aging of the lenses, and it gives you a gray look when you look at them on an angle, like a bluish gray in the back of the eye. Those aren't cataracts. Those are called, cause, uh, they're called nuclear sclerosis, and they're not usually treated. One thing you should be aware of if you see that, there could be a cataract form behind that. You need to have a veterinarian look at it and see if it is a cataract, and if he or she thinks it needs to be treated, then we refer you to an ophthalmologist and they can decide if they need to remove it or not. If they don't need to remove it, then we may be able to treat it or just let it go because they can see around it. And it's quite a serious procedure to do and they're not always successful in, in surgery because there's other things involved. Sometimes they'll get what we call uveitis and it'll, it'll be a secondary problem around the eye or a primary problem around the eye causing the cataract. So, we need to be cognizant of the fact that this is a serious problem and oftentimes clients think they're cataracts and they're really not cataracts. But as general practitioners, we refer to board certified ophthalmologists who are well qualified to treat these, these cataracts and, and make, the, make the dogs see. One thing I want to tell you is cataracts are sometimes secondary to diabetes and you need to, know to your, go to your veterinarian and make sure it's not diabetically induced cataracts. Anyway, go to your veterinarian, have it assessed, and then if they decide you need to go to an ophthalmologist, they'll refer to one in your area.